Well, it's often used to announce the official start of a Hawaiian ceremony or event. We're talking about blowing the conch shell. And this weekend, a special competition will be held just for kids. Joining me now to talk more about it is Kaleo boy Kia. Good morning. Thanks Good for morning, coming there. here. Good morning. Thank you for having me. First of all, the first of its kind competition. What is it about? Uh, actually, so the Aloha Festivals, uh, which is happening all this month, uh, partnered with the Pro Ridge Center to do the first ever Kiki Ho'olaulea. So there'll be many uh, events and activities for Kiki uh, on this day. And one of those activities is a conch blowing contest uh, for the Kiki. So it should be a lot of fun. Now, there is a technique. You don't, you don't just pick it up and start blowing. What is the technique? For sure. So there's, there's a technique to blowing it, and there's also a technique to kind of presenting yourself. You know, it's very special. It's made to uh, announce uh, events mm -hmm. or announce certain people. So mm -hmm. you want to have a certain stature. You want to have a certain posture. You want to be wearing certain things. And, of course, obviously, you want to have a certain technique when blowing it. Okay, and then how long have you been doing this? Uh, all my life, I believe. Uh, we've been, I've been dancing hula and uh, entertaining uh, with my family uh, for most of my life. So I learned at a very young age uh, how to do this, and it's a lot of fun. Okay, now Chris Latronic, I know we're going to bring him in because he's had a little bit of experience. Is there a way you can tell him more about the technique and teach yeah, him how? Yeah, for sure. So uh, it's much like uh, blowing a brass instrument, like a trumpet or a trombone or anything like that. Uh, like how I have to explain it is if you make like maybe a dime-sized hole with your fingers, and then you go ahead and kind of make a vibrating sound like a duck noise. Yeah, exactly. So that's kind of the technique. So when you do that, you want to make sure that the puka, the big shell, is pointing upwards so that you get the sound projected, and then you go ahead and make that duck noise into the shell like this. Just like that, Chris. Just like that. <laughs> Moment of truth. Here we go. Give it a shot, buddy. <laughs> no pressure. <laughs> Nice. Now, Chris, you did do this before, right? I used to, yeah, I used to dance for Tihati Productions and oh, actually nice. the Polynesian Cultural Center. So oh. I have done a few processions, but it's been a few years actually. So it's actually good to pick one up, and this one sounds actually like riding a bike. Yeah, like riding a bike. Sure. I think Hana Ho. I'm, I'm being asked Hana Ho. Yeah. One more time. Keep going. Thank you, Kaleo, no, for no, the refreshing. No, no, no. And one thing good, he never gives up. Oh, he never gives great. up. Never All right. Up. <laughs> right on. Thank you. Awesome. Let's, let's talk about the event. It is happening this weekend again. It is at Pearl Ridge Center Uptown. Yes, okay. And but but both events will be uptown and downtown. Mm -hmm. There you go. On your screen, 12:30 p.m. And Aloha Festival's Ho'olaulea all day from 10 to 3. But the Keiki competition at 12:30, Pearl Ridge Center. Uptown. Thank you so much for being here oh, and for, for teaching me. us. Yeah, and I'm so glad Chris fun. stepped in because I oh. wouldn't be able to do that. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. It was a great teacher. Great teacher. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you.